Hi everyone. I would love to read a book to you today, a book about penguins. Penguins are such interesting creatures. I love watching them waddle and go on their bellies through the ice and snow. Do you know that penguins live in the Southern Hemisphere, but not all of them live all the way down where it's so, so cold at the most Southern point of our world? They can live in temperate areas as well as being in cold, cold weather. Also, penguins like to eat, what do you think? Fish, krill, squid, do you know that their flippers look like wings, but penguins don't fly? But the book I'm gonna share with you is about a penguin who really, really wants to fly. But a penguin's flippers allow them to fly under the water. They're so agile and graceful when they're swimming. Um, did you know that penguins ha are black and white? to help them camouflage from their predators. Let's think about that. If they're swimming and their white bellies are under the water, if there's an orca whale looking up, he might think that it's just the reflection at the top of the water and not a penguin swimming by. And from above, the penguin would look dark and it would blend in with the waters of the ocean. Maybe you can look up some facts about penguins in Maybe write them down, make a little book, or draw a picture of a penguin. Okay, let's get going on the story. I'm going to share with you the book called I Can't oh, Can Fly. It is a book written by Fifi Kwa. Not sure how to say that author's name. This person also did the pictures for this book. I can fly. Take a look at the end papers. Did you know that that's what this is called? When you first open up a book, take a close look at this. It is showing you all sorts of drawings of penguins. Really cool. The, this book has end papers at the very beginning that look exactly the same as the end papers in the very back. I can fly. This looks like a penguin that perhaps lives in the very, very cold southern part of our world. Take a close look. Okay. Little penguin wanted to fly like other birds. Why can't I fly? asked little penguin. Ha! Huh said Gull. Penguins can't fly. But I do have wings, thought little penguin. So little penguin flapped. Then he flapped some more. And then he flapped really hard. Then little penguin waddled as fast as his little, little legs could carry him. And he leapt, whoosh, splat. He landed in front of his dad. What are you doing, little penguin? asked dad. I want to fly, said little penguin, like other birds. Penguins can't fly, said dad. Penguins swim. I'm sure I can fly, thought little penguin. So little penguin flipped and flapped his little wings and then he flipped and flapped some more. 
Little Penguin was exhausted. I know I can do better, said Little Penguin. Then he slipped, bumped, and tripped. And he fell, splash, into the sea. Dad was close by, and he took little penguin's wing. They swam below the sea. They leapt above the sea. They flew in the air and dived again and again. This is just like flying, thought Little Penguin. Swimming is like flying, isn't it, Dad? Almost the same, my Little Penguin. I can fly. <laughs> and here he is, crying, flipping and flapping, waddling, and realizing that he can fly. He just flies a little differently than the birds who are in the air. He is an aquatic bird, a flightless bird. His swimming is so beautiful. Did you notice something about this book? Anything about the colors in this book? I bet you did. Notice how the illustrations are all in black and white with just a hint of blue on every single page. I loved that. Let's turn to a different page and see. Is it black and white with just a bit of blue? Let's see. Can you guess what kind of penguin these penguins might be? Hmm, seems like a type, type of penguin that would live in Antarctica. Hmm, looks like a lot of snow and ice. I wonder. I hope you enjoyed my book about little penguin who can fly. And maybe you can try out, how can your body fly? We can't go way up in the air. But what could we do to make us feel like we're flying? Give it a try. Until next time, I'll see you soon. Bye.